Mike Haber. Thanks for asking me, do I have to go to a bond hearing in order to post bond in Florida? As is the case with many a legal question and answer, the answer here is maybe. Depending upon your charges and depending upon your particular situation, you may or may not have to go to a bond hearing. Let me explain. Florida Rule of Criminal Procedure 3.130 says that everyone who gets booked into a jail in the state of Florida must be taken before a judicial officer within 24 hours of booking for both probable cause and bond review. This rule applies everywhere across the state, but each of Florida's individual 20 judicial circuits have their own bond schedules. So if you're bondable upon booking, and if your bond is posted beforehand, then you're going to be released without having to attend this initial court appearance. But if your charges are not bondable, meaning if you are booked into a Florida jail for a capital offense, a life offense, or for some other offense where bond can't immediately be posted, say for instance, a domestic violence case or a DUI, or should you have a bondable charge, but there's some other hold on your person, like a bench warrant, a fugitive warrant, a child support warrant, an ice hold, or any of a number of other possible detainers, or if you are either on probation or if you are out on some other bond at the time of your current booking, then you're likely going to be held until at least after you've attended your initial appearance, be it in person or on closed circuit TV, and the judge has made a determination as to your bond status. A denial of bond at your initial appearance can always be challenged, and it can be readdressed at a later time. That said, I thank you for your question, I appreciate your having asked it, and I invite you to ask me more. Please remember that at Haber PA, it's all about reasonable doubt. And if you like this video, then please subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll be putting out more soon.